another nine to five job rant, okay? Hold up. I'm gonna go in the room real quick. Another nine to five job rant. Another, another one. Another nine to five job rant, okay? So, let me, so, you know, these are some, these are some new, new bullet points that I'm going to add on to this, to this fucking playlist that I got called nine to five job rants because, you know, there's been a few people that commented and said, Hey man, keep making these nine to five rent videos because I don't want to feel alone working, you know, like, like I don't want to feel alone, you know what I'm saying? As far, as far as this nine to five shit. So you know what brothers, I got you another rant. Okay. Number one, okay. Now, I remind you, these are these are new these these are new bullet points. If you guys want to watch more nine to five rants, go to my playlist, and it's a playlist called nine to five job rants. Click that. So, like these are th these are new shits that I'm talking about. So, when you go to work and you're at a boring ass fucking job, and you got be there for eight hours, right? What what do we all do? We all fucking daydream. We all fucking try to put our brain into a fantasy land so so uh so we can make so we can turn our mind off and so we can hurry up and get through the shift. I've done that plenty of times, man, especially at the job where I were at the hospital. I used to turn my brain off and just fantasize about me being rich or some other shit. It's anything just so I can, you know, just so I can distract myself for the time being, so I can hurry up and get through the day. Turn your brain off. You just turn that shit off. You know what I'm saying? So you can get through the fucking day. And then we all know these bitch ass fucking. You can't have your phones out. No phones. So because you can't, you can't get on your phone, you gotta fucking just turn your fucking brain off. Just so you can goddamn get through the fan. Fuck that shit. Fuck that okay i don't want to turn my brain off okay i don't want to fucking turn my shit off okay my brain is here for a reason i should be thinking all the fucking time you know thinking all 24 7 and i believe you know what i'm saying the only time that i should stop thinking is when i'm asleep but i still think that all of us still think even even when we sleep but the subconscious but but subconsciously not conscious obviously but yeah um, i even think that when we're asleep we think it's shit because you no. Know, have you guys ever, uh, ever encountered a problem and you needed a solution, but like you couldn't solve it? You go to sleep and soon as you wake up the next day, you find an answer. I think that was your brain going to work on that while you were asleep. So fuck that. I ain't trying to turn off my goddamn brain and shit. Another. <laughs> uh, what else? What else is there? Uh, I forgot. There was one more bulletin. There's another bulletin I had to add, dog. Uh, what, what's another one? Fuck. Um, um, what was the, what was the bullet? What, what, what was the thing I was finna say? Um, another, th well, okay, fuck it. I'm gonna go ahead and just say this one, cause the other one, I forgot about it. Um, what else? Uh, what else? Another one, okay? Um, accumulating vacation time. I should not have to accumulate vacation time, okay? Yesterday, I didn't feel like going to work. I said, man, I said, I, you know, um, uh, uh, I had, I had texted my boss. I said, hey, um. Yo, they uh, got the dog in the garage now and shit, but uh, d don't don't distract me while I'm making this video. But yeah, man, why the fuck? Like, okay, so basically, um, ba you know, video cut off. So basically, I had asked, yeah, yesterday, I didn't feel like going to work. I said, hey, listen, I ain't trying to go to work today because I, I you know, I just didn't feel like going. And my, you know, so um, I go ahead and text my boss and say, hey, you know, um, I can't, you know, I can't make it today. She said, oh, why is that? I said, because my car is acting up. I pretty much, I had lied like a motherfucker. I lied. <laughs> I lied. And she's like, oh, well, you know, you know, you have to, you have to be here because, because, you know, uh, because uh, you're new and you haven't, and you haven't accumulated vacation time to take time off. She said, she was like, you have to be here. And I, and, and she was like, well, and she was like, and if you and if you can't be here, then you're gonna be marked as a unexcused absence. I'm like, what the fuck? Who? The, I'm like, was tied into the nine to five shit. Now most people that are that that have been programmed to accept this, but oh yeah, that makes sense. But to a person who th who, who thinks outside the box, it doesn't make sense. 
who the fuck are you? Now, mind you, my boss is nice, so you know I can't. I ain't. I ain't trying. I ain't trying to get in her case. She's a nice lady. I ain't trying. I ain't trying to roast her. But who the fuck are you to tell me when I'm supposed to be somewhere and I need to accumulate time off? What the fuck is that? I have to accumulate time off. I have to build up the fucking time off. And and and, and typically, um, um, I believe she had told me how it works, but I forgot. So this, so basically, basically what I'm gonna do is, is uh, basically what I'm gonna do is, is just estimate uh, how many time off hours you get and shit like that. So I believe if you work one day of work, I believe you get like thirty minutes of time off or some shit. Like, but still, but because I'm new, I can't use it until after sixty days or some shit like that. So I believe after one day of work, uh, you get like. 30 minutes of time off. Um, I don't really know exactly because, like I said, uh, I forgot what she said when it came to that shit. But I believe basically what I'm saying is the fucking time off time that you get is a lot. It is is like a lot less. It is a lot less than the days that, that you work. So so if I work eight hours, I believe it's like 30 minutes or like an hour or some shit. I don't fucking know. But pretty much you have to fucking build that shit up. And then I can't use it until after 60 days. That's some bullshit. That is bullshit. Bullshit. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But it's all, oh yeah, you know, you you know, you and basically she had told me direct she had told me directly. She was like, hey, you know, you can't take time off because you're new. You know what I'm saying? So that means that you can't call off. You t you can't take time off because you're new. Okay, because you're new. All right. So you can't do it. Who the fuck are you to tell me when I can take time off? Why why is there a system in place? That, that that goddamn hinders my freedom. Who are you to tell me when I can take time off? Okay, I have to accumulate time off. I can't call off not a single time for a sixty day period. Fuck that shit. Fuck that shit. Okay, some bullshit. Some bull not bullshit nine to five horse shit. Bullshit. And finally, my last point. Um. I shouldn't have to lie in order to call off of work. I'm pretty sure all of us has lied at one point. Like I said, yesterday I lied. Oh, my car wasn't working. My car was working perfectly fine. I just had to I just had to make up an excuse to where, you know what I'm saying, to, you know, to where uh, the boss doesn't look at me a certain way so I don't get fired or some shit. Because if I was to say, hey, you know, I don't feel like going to work today, and why is that? Because, oh, are you sick? No, you know, I just don't feel like going. You know, that shit wouldn't sound right and that shit could maybe get me fired because because uh because at that point I look irresponsible or some shit. You know what I'm saying? I should not have to lie in order to fucking get some goddamn time off or some shit. That's some bullshit. Why do I have to lie to get time off or or fucking to not look bad or some shit? Fuck that shit. So yeah man, fuck that. I don't I shouldn't have to lie and fucking make myself look a certain way because you know because if I tell you the truth then, you know, saying you might fire me or you might be like, huh, what? So fuck that, man. I'm tired of this nine to five shit. Why do I, I shouldn't have to lie to you to goddamn get time off to where, to where I don't look bad to where you might fire me or, or you might fucking write me up as fucking, you know, unexcused absence or some shit. Because I believe because at jobs, uh, at jobs, um, you have sick days. Now, if you call off, say, hey, I'm sick. Okay. You know. That counts as a excuse absence. But if you go out the gate and say, hey, you know, I don't feel like going to work because I want to go to this party. Oh, that's unexcused absence. Fuck that. I shouldn't have to lie to you, motherfucker. Some bullshit. Fuck these nine to fives. I'm going to leave this shit soon. I'm tired of this job shit. <laughs> you have to accumulate vacation time. Fuck that. And lastly, I remember during the interview, she was like, yeah, and also, um, even if you're one minute late, that counts as a, that counts as a tardy. You're telling me that if I'm one minute late, that is a mark on my record type shit. That's like, that's like, bro, are you what, 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 a minute late? D that, that's going, that's going to affect the workplace that much that if I'm only 60 seconds late, th that's just going to change the whole fucking workplace. Because I'm not there for 60 seconds. Not a, not a couple hours. Not five days. But 60 seconds. That's like us being friends, right? I say, hey man, meet me at 530. You come at 531. And I'm like, 
Yo, I've been waiting all day. What took you so long? I've been waiting all day. Uh, 60 seconds ain't shit. That ain't nothing. That's not gonna... That is not a long time to be waiting for somebody. A, a minute late counts as a, you know, counts as a fucking mark, a mark on my record. Bullshit. It's not, I'm telling you, man, it's not five shit, dude. It's not it, bruh. It's not it, chief. I'm out of here, man. That's all I gotta say, dog.